Yep, so here we are at Ayotte Auto Parts, uh, Oxford, Maine, 210 Tiger Hill Road. Yeah, lots of old cars here. And uh, so this is the uh, main office, I guess. But he's got like a hundred acres of cars on both sides of the highway. Anything you can imagine is out here somewhere. Yep, so what's this? Uh, 53, 54? I'm not sure. But it's a stub nose. You can tell from the little hood. Most of this stuff looks like it's been here forever. Richard down there talking to himself. Uh, this is a 63 Chevy. Oh yeah, the two-door hardtop with the fancy convertible roof type. Fake convertible roof. Make a nice low rider for somebody. What else we got here? Oh look, some new stuff is in here. Still got shiny paint on it. It's got new struts, according to the sign. Are they still in there? There's still, there's still some struts in there. I don't know if I'd call them new, but they were at one time, but then it was a new truck at one time. A ton of wheels. The front end from a Jeep. Uh, probably from a Willys Overland. Yeah, the 60 Chevy. Uh, <laughs> Might have to walk out in the woods, huh? Yeah, guess so. But I have a machete. <laughs> yeah, we can hack our way through the underbrush yeah. or the overgrowth. Uh, so this is what it looks like during the summer. So this, is, yeah, you can't see anything in the yeah. summertime. Yeah. The last time we were here, there was some the, the snow stuff, on the ground. Yeah. yeah. And you could see things. Yeah, my wagon's a little easier to manage. Yeah. So, this is a uh, AMC Pacer. Yep. There's another one over there. Another one over there. Three of them. Huh? said Dave, the guy I painted his Crown Vic for him, said there's a Torino out here with a good trunk lid on it. Oh. Like the, like the Montego that we have. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm kind of confused. I'd have to call him and say, where is it? <laughs> huh. I think it's in yeah. this area, general area somewhere. Yeah, this side looks better. Yeah. It's got wood look. Mm. Yeah, that's an old Fairmont. Yeah, line. I'm lost. I don't remember where. The, oh, hey, there's the Vista Cruiser there's right the Vista there. Vista Cruiser right here, yeah. So we're not too far away. I don't know if it was over there or if it's over... I don't know. I think we gotta wander through the woods trying to find it. Yeah. Oh, no. Yeah. Got a GTO convertible. Or oh, maybe it's a Le Mans. Oh my god, there's a little chippy in it. On the tire. On the dually. Yeah, there's a chipmunk. Yeah, there's a little chipmunk. Hi, buddy. What's up? Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. The Firebird. Another 63 Impala. That one's a four door. Oh, it's an ambassador, and there's a international truck over there. This looks like some kind of an AMC. Oh, Grandma! Look at this. What? 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 Oh. Yeah. Wow. That's a pretty old. Whatever it is. Wow. 
Look at the engine. Look at the radiator cap. Whoa! It's got hinges on it, but that's I don't think cool. it opens. Yeah, that's interesting. I found it when you were looking for the Ford. Yeah. And you were walking through the woods and that's when you found it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure oh, it's not oh, around wait. here. Grandpa, it opens from the top. Huh? It opens from the top. Oh yeah, you got it open? It just opens from the top. Yeah. There's supposed to be a little hinge. Yeah, it's supposed to be a clip to hold it closed. Oh. There's, an old oh. There's two old sheets over here. If it says I can't read the Grandpa, tags. Fisher body. Yep, some more Jeeps. Yep. Oh, hey. Here's a Jeep. You know what I need off a flat fender Jeep? It's gone. I need a brass tag. Because the one on mine is missing. This one's missing too. Uh, here's a cowl section from a... Nope, that tag is missing too. Somebody likes those brass tags. So, yeah. What's that? Another Jeep over there? No, that's some farm equipment there. Manure spreader, I think. Or crap slinger. Let's see if this one's got the brass tag. Do you think the tag's on this one? I bet it's gone. Yep. No, it's gone. Because the serial number's on that tag. And the one I got, somebody stole the tag. So there's no serial number. Can't register it. Oh, uh, I'm so close to that Nice Le Mans with a big hood scoop. A broken hood scoop, but still. <laughs> it's... Uh, Next to another firebird. This is pretty well stripped. Uh, this is, uh, yep, it's kind of like a Mercury point. Comet. Oh. Found the, uh, the other guy was talking about. Oh. Yep. It's not the right year, but it's a Pontiac. What happened to this thing? Yeah. Sixty-two Pontiac. Auto. Uh -huh. It's probably a 62 then. Yep, we need 64. Yep. What's up, buddy? Come on. Yeah, come here. I know it is. Oh, yeah, they do. Oh, yeah, there's a Stasky and Hutch Torino. Now, they didn't have a fastback. Yeah, the Torino's over there. It looks good, but there's no door panels. Huh. Firebird. Funny looking though. Like yeah. in there. So, let's see. see what I can do. Yep. So, this is the Pontiac we've been looking for. And it's the Sun Vista. It's the Canadian model. Oh, is it? Yes, that's what that's Star called. Star Chief. And Sun, Sun Chief is the Canadian model, I guess. Star Chief, it says. Star Chief, yeah. Hmm. It's online. <laughs> uh. Up for grabs. I got the latch I need. Yeah, 62 Chevy. Two door hard top. Yeah, it's all kinds of stuff around here. Dodge pickup. There's uh, one of them weird looking Buicks. Uh, 
There's a Riviera up there, 70, 71 rib, with the boat tail, Ford pickup truck. That's over there, another pacer wagon. There's a bunch of pacers here, because this is the best place for them. There's a Volkswagen Beetle over there. Uh, there's a lot of Volkswagens here. There's Beetles, there's Squarebacks. Uh, there's uh, vans, Volkswagen vans. And uh, I don't know if this is a Hornet wagon or an Eagle. The Eagle's a four-wheel drive. Yeah, so here's the Boat Tail Riviera. Kind of stripped and it's missing the trunk lid. Rear bumper looks pretty nice. If anybody needs one. And the back glass is good. There's a Vista Cruiser. Missing the, the glass. Roadrunner. And it's all all there it's missing the door uh, I think this is one of those four-wheel drive rigs yeah uh, Eagle and that may be another one of them there but uh, it's like a 318 in the Roadrunner I don't think it's any good the fenders are no good that one's got a piece rusted out of it <laughs> This one's pretty bad. What do we got inside? Stock steering wheel, if anybody needs one. One bucket seat. And a Fury 3. Yep. That's interesting. VW Beetles. We got a few here. all this wasted space it could be full of old cars it's like a 39 Pontiac coupe with the back end cut off I don't know if they made it into a pickup truck or, or if somebody needed a the back of a coupe but it's uh, kind of been stripped See, that's got the Pontiac thing down the middle of the hood. I don't know exactly what year it is. Maybe somebody else will put it in the comment section. Looks like a fiberglass hood. Nope, it's aluminum. Ha. Huh. Uh, looks like an old uh, Plymouth, Plymouth Coupe, minus the front sheet metal. And there's another Plymouth sedan over there. And looks like another one here. All right, let's get the sewer, four door suicide doors. Yeah. Front doors are missing. What's the cotton nose cowl? Is oh, the front door is sitting there. Yep. Somebody took it off and left it. Yep. The bottom's all rotted out of it. A lot of these cars are probably more parts than anything now. Yeah, probably nothing worth saving here. I guess it's Mercury. Because it's kind of
kind of looks like uh, 69 Ford front fenders, but yeah. the grill sticks out too much. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. But otherwise, it looks like my 69 Torino. Yep. Yeah. So that's probably what that is, a Mercury version of the Torino. Oh, yeah. And, uh... One of those old Barracudas, and here's a Roadrunner, I believe. Yeah. Looks like a Roadrunner. one, anyways. Yeah. Non-restorable Roadrunner. Yeah. Chopped up and pretty good. Original Barracuda. The glass window, still good. Huh. They break these on TV all the time. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I've seen, I think, three different shows where they said, be careful not to break that because... It's uh, hard to replace, and I knew as soon as they said that they were going to break it. And sure enough, they broke them all the time. Constantly breaking those things. <laughs> Just for the drama. Yeah. What Corvairs. I know, right? But there's one of them there. There's a 65 or 66. Yeah. I thought that was off yep, the bottom. The motor's still in there. Yeah. Dual carburetors. See the air filter, the air intake. Uh, carburetor on yep, this side. Somebody and that stole one's the carburetor off that one. Yeah. Oh, that's the, the yeah. lock mechanism there. Yeah. There it is. Yeah. A four-door Corvair. Wow. I didn't know that right. I didn't know that either. And there's another one that's only got two doors. Yep. And uh. That is a Plymouth convertible. Another Cuda with the back window. Oh, yeah. There's another Way one with the back there. window. That one's a newer one, though, back over here. Because that's yeah. good. That doesn't have the, it doesn't shape down around. It comes, yeah. it's just like almost like a V. Huh. Yeah. Mustang. Good trunk lid, good back window. Good roof. Wow. Good Kinda. hood. <laughs> Got doors. Yeah. An extra door here, different color. And uh, what the? Six cylinder? Huh. Ah, that's odd. Six cylinder. Mm. God, there's an awful lot of stuff out in the woods you can't see. I know, right? You could be. So long. It could take you a week, and you still couldn't see it all. Yeah. And this is the other side. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think anybody wants any Rambler V8s. Yeah, I know, huh? <laughs> yeah. What is she? Oh, wow. Well. There. Uh, an old caddy over there. Yep. And uh, another. Fairlane, but uh, Galaxy maybe, further out. Yeah. Yeah. Can't tell from here. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah. This is a Dodge of some sort. The grill looks nice. Somebody needed a grill for one of them. Another four-door like Corvair. Those. Almost the same front, the front there, you know? Yeah, there's a, there's a Marlin. Yeah. Very rare Marlin. Yeah, it's still got the, fen the fenders are still in here. Okay. Fenders, the dash, some um, yeah. old mobile of York lens. I think it's pretty much an uh, ambassador with the different tail end on it. Yeah. So if you cut the back half off, you could turn it a Rambler Ambassador into a uh, one of these. Mm -hmm. uh, another Riviera front yep. wheel drive. Uh, probably a 85 or 6. This looks like an AMC door oh, handle. It was, yeah. <laughs> yeah. The door handle looks like a Rambler or AMC. So. That's probably what this was. Oh, I bet it's a javelin. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Yeah. AMC javelin. Yeah. What is this guy now? Oh yeah, a little valiant. 
Yeah. Yes, they wanted the fins. Yeah, it had slanted cat's eye tail lights on. Oh, yeah, yeah. More Pontiacs right there. Yeah. Just off into the bushes. You can see the Pontiac nose, Model J. Yeah. Probably. Come over here, you can see the tail lights of that one. Well, that might have been a, um, what do they call those? Bonneville, maybe? Yeah. yeah. Could be. I'm not going to walk all the way out there to see. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not looking for the park, so I'm not going to walk that far. Some parts. Come on, come on. Nice Lincoln, but it doesn't have the suicide doors. Mm -hmm. Got the headlight doors. Ah, that's okay. That's another Chrysler. Right? Yeah, it's some kind of a Chrysler convertible. Yeah, and all their bird streets are falling down, anyways. Yeah, I think we're in the Volkswagen bust uh, so, huh? area. <laughs> yeah. Well, at least three of them. Yeah. Two, four, five. Yeah. There's a cut down beetle. Huh? Cut the back right off. That's like a little bit. Yeah. There's another one there with a tree on it. There's a couple more Corvairs over there. Yep. Another Corvina. Yeah. No, there's a javelin. Oh, another javelin. Yeah. to get something out of here. Yep. Somebody, somebody must have paid good money for whatever was parked here, huh? Yeah. To do this much work. Yeah. Well, I mean, I just spent 300 bucks on a few car parts. So. Yeah. <laughs> I knew you knew what some of the stuff was worth. Yeah, this is Volkswagen motor. Yeah. Well, in fact, Mustang too out there. Yeah. It's still not very popular. <laughs> no. Unless they have the 289 in them. You know? Yeah. Yeah, that. Somebody was buying some Yep. Bunch of Volkswagen parts. Yes sir. <laughs> you can fix anything if you put your mind to it. All right, like these yeah. back doors. A little bit of sheet metal and that'd be good as new. Stitch them in, stitch some new sheet metal in there. There's a rare antique tail light hanging off of this loose door. Oh, this is the good side. It's got a running board on it. Oh, it's, the running uh, board's still on this side, Dad. It's just... Oh, it's buried, huh? Oh. Yeah, so this is either a 35 or a 36 Ford. The only difference was the grill and the chrome trim, and since all that's missing, there's no way to tell. Yep. But there used to be a lot of 49, 50s and stuff down in here, yep. and now they're all gone. That must have oh. been stuck to the other door, huh? Yeah, that is a door. Maybe we should put it back on. Uh, <laughs> gee, it's too bad it's not the driver's side. Yeah, huh? I need that top piece of the driver's side, but that one's rusted through anyway. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, yeah. Uh, the key's not in it. We can't go for a ride. <laughs> yeah, I guess he cleaned out a lot of the older stuff down in here. Yeah. Yeah, there's a back quarter from an old car, and there's a back half. Caliper stuck. Yeah. Oh. Well, yeah, it's been stuck a few years now. The 
V6 Fiero. Yep, it's got a manual tranny in it. Huh. I bet it was fun when it was on the road. Yeah, and it didn't burn up like most of them did. At least I don't see any signs of fire. fire engine. I believe it says Federal on there. Grill's missing. I don't know. It should have a... That's heavy. <laughs> yeah. And where? Right here. Right in front of me? Yeah. Oh. Wow, you found it. Oh, it looks so cool. Where? Right in front of me? <laughs> 